Hey guys, Matt here. All right, well, I swore I never would put any more Dunstans in my orchard at the house here, but uh, I ran into a deal that was too good to pass up at Walmart, of all places. So uh, I picked up this morning, I picked up 10 Dunstan chestnuts from, uh, from Walmart. As you can see, they're from Chestnut Hill and they're normally $39.97. The reason I'm doing this video is I wanted to, uh, I'm sure everybody that that uh, grows chestnuts or is aware of this probably already knows, but um, if uh, you wait long enough and your Walmart is one of the few that receives chestnuts from Chestnut Hill, um, usually if you're nice enough, talk to the... Um, the manager of the um, nursery department they'll usually um, be nice enough to mark the trees down for you if you talk to them nice enough and um, I was lucky the that I actually went to school with the with the guy that was over the um, the nursery department but anyway um, I talked to him and uh, was able to negotiate a price of $15 a tree. As you can see here, they normally sell for $39.97. So um, I thought that was a pretty good deal. Couldn't pass that up. So like I said, I swore that I would never plant any more Dunstans here at the home orchard, but I have a few blank spots where I've been uh, struggling to get trees started. And I thought, well, um, was able to get these trees at a good price that I think is a good price. So might as well um, put these here. And then at the very least, if I decide to do something different um, in a couple of years after they get good and established, um, I can um, use them as graft stock. Um, so here's one. For, I can use them as graft stock for another uh, Chinese chestnut variety because that's really all a Dunstan is. It's a Chinese chestnut with very minimal American uh, characteristics. So there you go. There's one. Here's the other. It's in a little bit better shape and I don't know if you know, I had to go back to the other one. Uh, I had just had a truck to haul these in. Didn't have a covered trailer or anything. So they got a little wind, wind whipped as I was uh, hauling them back. So that's why the leaves look a little wilted right now. And I, have, I haven't watered them in good yet. So I just got them in the ground. This one, uh, you can see, um, this right here. This isn't frost damage or anything like that. This is just from uh, carrying them home. Um, they'll bounce back, no problem. But here's the little uh, sticker that comes on the chestnut tree. Uh, if you, you know, when you buy them from Walmart, it has a little um, information about the Dunstan. Uh, these are the three gallon trees. Uh, my particular Walmart, had um, 20 in stock at the time that I purchased these. I purchased 10 and there were 10 extra or 10 other trees. And I intend to go back in probably two or three weeks, see what there is left. And then uh, try to make a deal for the rest of them. Maybe even try to get them cheaper. Cause it really is at least here in Texas, pushing the date for uh, planting stuff. I mean, it really is kind of late here. Um, it's already getting warm. All right, so here is the info that you get with the tree. So I just thought I'd share that. It does say that, you know, a Dunstan 
does have just a tiny, tiny bit of American in it, but I mean, it really is not much. I mean, for all intents and purposes, it, it's, it's a Chinese tree. And uh, there have been studies done on that. So um, anyway, I, I have no doubt that if I were to um, take um, some graft, some Chinese um, graft stock and uh, or, or Chinese graft uh, wood and use this these uh these two trees as graft stock that i would have no problem with getting it to take hopefully anyway but uh anyway so i wanted to uh do a little quick video show you guys what i've been up to i still have a couple of spots left in the orchard way up there in the front right there at the tip of my finger i have a little seedling tree started so that spot is taken right there at the tip of my finger is a blank spot the only one that's left and I have some seedling trees started I'll walk over and show you right quick that I plan on putting in that spot so that I just don't have Dunstans everywhere so I'll pick the best one best tree out of out of these right here and these are colossal seeding seedlings and I'll stick one of those in that blank spot over there and I'll put the rest I won't I won't let those I won't let those uh, seedling trees go to waste I'll put the rest of those in uh, um, grow bags and we'll we'll grow those out but uh, anyway, so that's the uh, what's happening here at the home orchard. All right, guys, take care.